is a $15 million gaming room, and it's the coolest gamer room in the entire GTA dimension. But I also have a $1 million gamer room, $500,000 gamer room, all the way down to this $1 room. Each gamer room will come with better gaming equipment, but can I get my hands on the $15 million ultra gaming room? <sighs> okay, just the place I want it to be. A random house? Yeah, well, you see, Guido, there's something very special about this random house. Down there is Billy's gamer room, and it looks awesome! Wait, really? How come Billy gets a gamer room and we don't? That's the thing with bullies, Guido. They always get what they want! Hey, Billy, why don't we get Steve to log on so we can destroy him with our epic gamer skills? Ha! You really think Steve could afford a GS5? This is the most powerful games console in the multiverse! You shouldn't even use Steve's name in the same sentence! Ah. Whoa, are you okay, Steve? I'm fine, really. Billy doesn't even know that I've got my own gamer room ready to go. And it's right here. What an epic gamer room, Steve. Just look at that flange. Oh, Guido, that's supposed to be my desk. And as you can see, it is missing a games console. So let's go ahead and check the shop right here. And as you can see, there is a bunch of gaming equipment I can browse from this $1 Retro Boy all the way down to this super expensive $15 million Ultra PC. Hey, it comes with a gaming room. What you doing, Steve? Well, the only one I can really afford is the Retro Boy. And ha! our journey to that Ultra PC begins right now, starting off with the $1 Retro Boy. Whoa, look at this. Yeah, it's so old. Yeah, well, it may be old, Guido, but look at that. If we can get the high score on Hyper Snake today, we'll win $100. Looks like the high score is 20, so that should be very beatable. Okay, so the only way we can fail is if we eat our own tail, so we've got to be very careful here. Go down here, get that one. There we go, across here. Oh, jeez. Okay, we're halfway done. This is some epic gameplay right here, Guido. Not gonna lie. Come on, we're on 17. Oh, jeez. 19. One more. Come on. Oh, jeez, I just missed it. Okay. Yeah, got it. And look at that. New high score. Progress has already been made, and we can upgrade our gaming room even further. Let's hop back onto the store again. Swipe to the rooms tab. Oh, Billy is gonna be so jealous. Uh, looks like we can only really afford this hotel room, which is going to be $50 a night. So we're staying there for two nights, right? Actually, Guido, I'm going to stay there for one night and use the remaining $50 to buy a GS2. It's another pretty old console, but still, it's better than nothing. Okay, let's get to the hotel room and get ready for our new gamer room. <laughs> Okay, this isn't as glamorous as I was expecting. Hey, for $50, it's not bad. Yeah, well, you know, the bed isn't even made. There's a big stain on this couch. But at least I have my GS2. Uh, I hope you kept the receipt. Now, Guido, the GS2 comes pre-installed with one game, and that's Duty Calls. This used to be the most popular shooter game in the entire multiverse, so let's log on. Then we just need to pick an awesome name for our soldier here, so let's go for Lance Corporal Epic. Whoa, this is so cool! The graphics are so realistic! Not sure they had those back in the day, but hey, maybe the developers took some creative liberties. Okay, let's dive down here. We should have a parachute. Oh, this is so cool. Oh, jeez. Was that a glitch? Yep, looks like it, dude. It's a pretty old game, but anyway, look. It looks like nobody else is on the server right now. Want me to spawn some bots in? Yes, please. Whoa, hey, I see them, Guido. Oh, my gosh. The fight has begun. Now, I've only got a pretty basic starter gun here, so uh, I'm not really expecting us to do too good. Oh, jeez. Yeah, there we go. We also have to figure out a way... Oh, my gosh. A way for us to make money, because right now, I don't really see how we can upgrade our gamer room even more. Where is this guy going? Hey, come back here. You're doing great, Steve. There's got to be more bots around here somewhere. Uh, whoa, hey, that guy's got a rocket launcher. We've got to find back. He's going to stand down. Oh, never mind. Ha! These bots are so stupid. I wish there was another player online to do better. Wait, wait what's this? Bluebeard34 has logged on? What are you doing in my lobby, noob? This game is for bros only. Oh, and this guy definitely looks like a pro. Oh, what's a noob, Chris? Quiet, Austin. I'm gaming. Hey, I may be new to this game, but that doesn't mean I'm a noob. I can take you on. Bring it on. Oh, 
Oh, Guido, looks like he's got some kind of armor on. He must be a high-level player. Yeah, this isn't fair. I've only just started. Hey, get out here, you camper. Come on, run around like I'm doing. Okay, he's moving from cover. This could be the opportunity. Oh, jeez. Oh, my gosh, he just did an awesome roll. I've still got this in the bag. He shouldn't be able to see me if I move this low. There we go. Uh, oh, he's totally confused. Wait. <laughs> I'm totally confused. Where did he go? Uh, well, this is awkward. Uh, uh, take this! Hey, 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 truce! Truce! Ugh, fine. Truce. I guess we are the only two players on this game. How about this? A little challenge. If you manage to capture that flag and bring it back to your base without me killing you, I'll give you 1,000 bucks. What? 1,000 bucks? How do I know I can trust you? Oh, my God. Gosh, where did he even get that kind of money from? Chris, have you seen my pocket money? Okay, so there's the flag. I've just got to grab it and bring it all the way back to my base without dying. Then a thousand bucks is as good as ours. <sighs> okay, deep breath, Steve. He's on top of that tower. We can do this. Here we go. I'm going. Even the tent, Steve. It's the only bit of cover we can use. I'm going, I'm going, but he's still sniping down at me. Come on, come on. Nice! We're taking it here, Steve. Yeah, but we're still far from the flag. All right, that is my next piece of cover. Oh, let's go! Go, 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 go! Zigzag! Hey! Quit moving so fast! No! But you're making this hard for me! Perfect! Sure am! Now, now, Guido, I want this to be fair. Seems like he's waiting for us to make a move, so let's not keep him waiting! Gotcha! Okay, now to get back. He got the flag. Time to go mobile. Going mobile? What the heck is he talking about? I'm not sure, Guido, but I've got to get this flag back right now. Hey, you can't use vehicles. That wasn't in the rules. Oh, I don't care. Look out, Steve. He's coming for a three-minute Oh, uh, yeah, I know, dude. This is so unfair. Wait, what is this? Hey, Guido, this Os de Boss guy is offering me hacks for $100. Well, Bluebeard doesn't play nice, so let's do it! Ho oh, ho, Hank's a navel! Let's give this a shot and whoa! Oh my gosh! What the? That can't be legit! Uh, yeah, Bluebeard is actually very legit. It's just only for high level players. Okay, let's get ourselves some control here. Uh, and we are right outside of our base and we should be able to. Yes, we won! That a thousand bucks is as good as my. Whoa! I think I'm gonna get out of here. Whoa, that was awesome! Whoa, the a thousand bucks! Hey, Bluebeard was Chris this entire time? Obviously. Now that we've got a thousand bucks, I can afford the GS5. Let's head to the mall. Cha-ching! Thank you so much. I can't believe the new GS5 is in this box. Guido, they could have done better with the design. Ah, <laughs> uh, Billy! Oh, hello, Steve. Fancy seeing you here. Listen. I know what you're doing, and it's not gonna work. That ultra PC and gaming room is mine. I'm gonna buy it first. Yeah, well, good luck with that, Billy. My gaming room is gonna be so much cooler than yours. You'll see. All right, Guido, we'll get back to the hotel room, and on the way, we'll buy some new decorations, like this epic gamer chair and this cool neon sign. Really cool, Steve, but still not as cool as Billy's room. <sighs> I know, dude. Let's just see what we can play on the GS5. Whoa, Guido, just look at this game. The graphics are so crisp. It's so much better looking than Duty Calls. Looks like some kind of racing game. Is this my car? Oh my god. Wow, Steve. You look even cuter in game. Look, Lily, what are you doing here? Oh, now, now, don't play coy with me. How about we race three laps? And if I win, I get to call you my boyfriend. Wait, what? Hold on a second. <laughs> Let's go. Wait, no, I didn't agree to any of this. Oh, Guido, we have to win. Now, I have done a little bit of research into this game, Guido, and I know that up ahead there is an upgrade ring. And when we drive through it, you get a random car like Lily just got a supercar. Let's hope we get something good then. Here we go. Yeah. Oh, come on, are you kidding me? Oh, it's so slow. Oh, sucks for you, Stevie Weeby. <laughs> one lap down. Oh, whatever, Lily. Okay, that's one lap down for me as well, but I'm just so slow. And look, Lily just got another upgrade. Hey, she got a bike too. 
Yeah, but that one looks a lot faster than mine, doesn't it, Guido? Come on, please give me something good here. Uh, okay, this is slower, but it's definitely more impressive. You know what, Guido? We've got a tank. Why don't we just go ahead and park ourselves right here and protect the ring? That's a good idea. I mean, Lily is on lap three already. And boom! No upgrades for you, Lily. Okay, that's bought us some time. Let's keep moving. Lap three, here I come. Oh my gosh, I can't believe you made it under there. Hey, look, there's Lily. She's going through the upgrade ring. It's all going to come oh, down to no. this. That isn't fair. Oh, sorry, Lily. Just the look of the draw, I guess. See you later. No. This is the best car in the multiball. Oh, jeez. Oh. 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 Easy peasy. No. <laughs> oh, no. Lily seems very mad. Is Lily in the ring next door? Oh my gosh, Guido, she is raging hard. Look how much stuff she's destroyed. She must really hate losing. Actually, Guido, I think it's just because I'm not her boyfriend now. Uh, not like I ever was. I'm out. Oh, it's such a shame to waste all this stuff. You know what would have been so much more productive? If someone sold it. What, in the multiverse? We got $10,000 for some broken stuff? Well, with that amount of cash, we can actually start to automate our business a little. I'll buy three GS5s, set them up in my room, and let the people of the GTA dimension play them whenever they want for $15 an hour. Whoa, we're already earning money! That's right, dude. And with that money, I can buy myself a VR headset. Oh, Guido, it is another beautiful day in the GTA dimension. Oh my gosh! Look at the size of that queue! They must be here to use our GS5s! Oh, they must be! Oh my gosh, we've already earned $25,000? That is insane! But I want more! Let's check out our brand new VR headset and see if there's any opportunities to make more money there. Ooh, look at this! Horror Escape! Sounds spooky! And it'll be even spookier in VR! Yeah, but look, the developers are offering $500,000 to anyone who can complete it. I'm in. Ugh. Oh, Guido, is this what everyone's scared of? A little bit of rain and a maze? Ugh, I can do this. Are we sure we can do this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, what's the issue? It's not like anyone's here with me or something. Uh, Guido? What the heck was that? Okay, uh, this is fine. It must be my imagination or something. Uh, okay, the sooner I can get out of this maze, the better. But which way... Am I supposed to go? That's blocked off. Maybe through this way. Uh, okay, Guido, there is definitely something here with me. Will you just hurry up and keep moving? Okay, maybe it's this way or something. Uh, oh, thank the multiverse. Other people. Hey, guys, do you think you could help me get out of here? Guys? Uh, uh, run! Uh, uh, Guido, what the heck is that thing? I don't know, but it's right behind us. Oh, no, no, no. It's blocked. It's blocked. Oh my gosh, he's hideous! Okay, if I can't go through him, I'm gonna go over him! Uh, uh, hey, Guido, I can't hear him anymore. Maybe we're sick. Oh, oh, oh no, no, there's another blockage! Uh, maybe back the way we can. Oh no, definitely not! What? Guido, what is that? I can't even see! Looks like the developers really want us to quit! No, I don't want to quit, no matter how scary this gets! Oh my gosh, there he is! That was awesome! And the exit is right there! Come on, come on! Yes! Oh my gosh, that was insane! And hey, look at this! We've got a message from the developer confirming that we won $500,000! Just for that? Oh, come on, Guido. It was really scary. And in the meanwhile, these guys have been playing away on the GS5s, earning me some money, a total of $100,000 to be specific, which is now going to go towards my advanced gaming PC. Now, this isn't the Ultra PC, which comes with a free, awesome gaming room, but it is still pretty cool. Now, with this money, I'll add some more decorations to the room, like this neon sign, some additional TVs, and for some light snacks, a vending machine. Hey, this gaming room is looking so much better already. Let's go see how Billy's doing. I've been working so hard over the past couple of days. There's no way that Billy can be catching up with me, right? Another solid day of collecting lunch money. Let's just add this to the PC fund. Bam! Bad news, Steve. Billy has also gotten a 
an advanced gaming PC. Wait, what? Oh, so we're neck and neck. Ah, the only way I'm going to win this war is if I sabotage Billy. Okay, let's get back to our setup. Now, Guido, I don't really have much space anymore, so I've had to put the advanced gaming PC in here. What? It's fine. Look, the PC can still run Knight's Realm, the biggest online fantasy game in the entire multiverse. Whoa, look at this place. And Steve, are you an elf? Honestly, Guido, not really sure what I am. But look, Billy has just logged online, and this is where I'm going to sabotage him. Now, the thing is with Billy, he always tries to make himself look tougher than he actually is. So I'm guessing his character is some kind of massive, bulky, handsome knight or something. Uh, someone like that guy. <clears throat> Hello there, fair knight. I challenge you to a duel. Ha! Look at this level one noob challenging me. This should be fun. You want to fight? Let's fight. You see, Guido, we've got a really big problem. Because Billy is level 999, our attacks can barely damage him. I mean, look at that. So we're going to have to delve into the world of microtransactions. Oh my gosh, how much do these cost? Okay, you know what? Never mind. We need every advantage we can get here. Let's buy 100 times damage. And let's see exactly what's changed. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. Can we do it? Is he dead? No, Guido, he's got the armor, so he's still alive. And look, we barely did any damage to his health bar. We're going to have to buy another microtransaction here, dude. The Demon Sword. That's right. This is the most powerful sword in the entirety of Knight's Realm. And it was ours for a very low price of 10,000 bucks. Let's see if it was worth it. Oh, jeez. Definitely worth it. Just a few more hits here. Oh, my gosh. We knocked him down into the water. What's going on? I'm supposed to be the strongest player on the server. Wait, I can't see Billy anywhere. Hold the phone. I think this is like quicksand or something. I think he's drowning. Look at his health bar. We almost got him. That noob is going to beat me. Better download some hacks. Did you hear that, Steve? I heard, Guido, but this is exactly what we want. Because sooner or later, Billy is going to download a dangerous hack. What's this? Virus? Eh, probably nothing. And his PC is going to be fried. My computer? No! Uh, hello? Billy? Still there? Guido, I think he fainted. <laughs> oh, yes, that was awesome. Steve, we got a message. It's from a rich person that wants to buy our Knight's Realm account for one million dollars. We should take it. Yeah, we should. Hmm. Actually, Guido, I think I've got a better idea. What? what? You can't be serious. Well, if you pass me the phone, I'll go on social media and broadcast that my next level Knight's Realm account is now available for anyone in the GTA dimension to play on for $50,000. Would people actually pay for that? Huh. I don't know, Guido. Would they? Boom! And there it is! $15 million! Which means we have one final purchase to make, and that is the $15 million Ultra Gaming PC with the gaming room. And here we are, Guido. This room is amazing! Now let's get this gaming session underway. You know this PC cost $15 million, Steve. Was it worth it all for this? Uh, yeah. 